Hi, my name is James Radley from jamesrad.com and today I'm just bringing you a quick shot video on uh, Lee McIntyre's workshop that I attended in uh, Manchester in August and basically how it changed uh, my outlook on internet marketing. You're probably wondering who, who I am, well there's a picture of me and, uh, and you're asking yourself, well why should I listen to you? Well, I did attend, like I said, at that workshop, his first ever workshop in Manchester, and it taught me so much. And I'm just going to give you a, a brief uh, intro into what it did teach me. Uh, but first of all, I'll, I'll tell you some of the, the problems I had and why I was failing, basically, because one of the reasons was because I was dreaming and not doing. You know, I've got to take action, and you have to take action within your business. And instead of, you know, dreaming, you need to start taking action. I was following far too many internet marketers, far too many, trying to put everything uh, into action and, and not really sort of sticking to one thing. I had no action plan, I had no no goals that I'd set and you you must do yourself an action plan and start setting yourself goals, it really will motivate you. I was reading far too many emails and I was buying far too many products and really the, none of them was helping me at all. I was basically an information collector, that's what I was. So what changed? Well, Lee McIntyre say I did attend his workshop in Manchester, and it really did change the outlook of uh, I have of internet marketing. It was two days full of content, absolutely packed from nine till six, short breaks, quick hour for lunch. It was absolutely packed full of content. It basically went through the whole process of setting up an online uh, information business, and. Uh, he talked about how to succeed and, and the pitfalls to watch out for, the mistakes he's made, but mainly how he's learnt from them mistakes and he sort of put uh, put them mistakes behind him, learnt from them and moved on and obviously he's created a heck of a successful business. I also met so many uh, like-minded internet marketers. It really was good to start talking to other people. You know, I've got email addresses and, and, and talked to a few of them since and it, it was good to do that. I walked away from them two days basically with my head packed full of ideas. So was that it? Did I go and make thousands after attending that workshop? Well basically no I didn't. <laughs> not yet anyway. Uh, hopefully I will. Um, it's probably not the answer you was expecting but it is the truth. So did Lee fail? Was the workshop rubbish? Simple two answers. No and no. Lee didn't fail and the workshop wasn't rubbish. The problem was my mindset. Although I started to take action, I started to put that content that Lee had given me and started to make my own products and my own blog and everything, I fell back into my old ways. I got back into reading all them emails, buying them products, you know, drifting around the scene and not getting on and doing the main tasks that will be beneficial for my business. I fell back into that black hole of internet marketing. I went looking for the easy button again you know drifting through what shall I do shall I do a bit of affiliate marketing shall I do some CPA offers you know instead of just concentrating on something which would be beneficial to me I started waiting for success to come to me I started thinking well if Lee can be successful and if all these other people can be successful then that means I must be successful you can't wait for success to come to you you've got to go out there and you've got to grab it you know I visited the hellhole of internet marketing I really did and I visited that yesterday on the 5th of October that was my worst day ever got nothing done just kept going round and round in that vicious circle and I was very close to quitting yesterday I was very close to throwing it all in throwing the laptop out the window if you like so basically what happened well I received an email this morning well I opened it this morning it came through last night and that email was sent by Lee McIntyre and I'm sure many of you got that email about his, uh, his second workshop that he's got in Manchester in uh, later on in this month but it featured one of my blog posts that I'd done I'd done this blog post uh, a few days after coming back from his, his previous workshop and what that basically did to me is it made me go back to my blog which I hadn't visited in about three weeks and made me read that blog post again and it re-motivated me, it really re-motivated me and reminded me just what sort of content Lee had given me and what I should be doing with my time and how I should be using that time. You know, I took 25 pages of notes over them two days. I've sat and gone through them again. Unfortunately, I can't read all of it because I was scribbling that fast. But, you know, I, I certainly got to, got the main gist of everything I'd wrote. And it's, it's definitely re-motivated me and reminded me 
uh, you know, to get on and and do this. And obviously they've got his uh, his workshop, which, like I say, is coming up uh, later on in the, in this month, the 23rd and the 24th of October. One of the other things that uh, the video this morning that I watched of Lee, what, one of the other things it did, it's made me create this video. Do you know, just a quick little video. It's my first ever video I've created, but it's overcome a fear. It's overcome a fear of creating videos. You know, is it technically too advanced for me? Can I do it? Can I talk uh, to people? You know, you play it back to yourself. And it, and you cringe at your own voice, but but it's not difficult. You know anybody can create a video with with a quick microphone, uh, headset, and you know a few bits of software, PowerPoint, and a few slides, just like I've uh, I've done here. So basically, you might be saying, "What's this got to do with you?" Well, I'm I'm basically giving you the heads up. You need to be there. You really do need to be at this workshop. You need to stop watching this video and start taking action. You need to start listening to Lee McIntyre because he really is different from all the rest of the internet marketers out there. Really is different. He gives you so much and he takes very little. You know, <laughs> you think, well, who are you saying that? But he, he really does give you so much content and ask so little for it. Go check out his offer that he's got for his new his new workshop. You won't believe it and you certainly will be shocked at the price. If unfortunately you get there and it's sold out or you can't make it, you can't afford, um, even though it's a low price, you still might not be able to afford it, and then just go visit his blog. Go read his blog. There's so much free training on his blog. You wouldn't believe it. Many people would put that sort of training together and sell it for thousands of dollars. Lee's just chucked it out there free. And because it's free, it doesn't mean it's rubbish. It really is good content. What you then need to do is you need to make an action plan. You must set yourself an action plan and then you must put that plan into action. You must go out there and do it. Not just read about it, you must go out there and do it. And don't fall like I did, don't fall back into the black hole of internet marketing. Unsubscribe from them email lists, that's wasting your time. You know the ones I mean, that's spamming you, just sending you offer after offer and never really giving you any good advice please just unsubscribe from them and change your mindset. I've done it, I've created this video, I'm sure you can do it as well, but change your mindset, start thinking of it as a business. Just want a couple of quick things why I made this video, you know, it was to give something back, I sent this video back out to Lee to see what he wants to do with it, but it was to give something back to Lee, but it was also and mainly to actually prove to myself that I can do it. So thank you very much for listening to me. Uh, so my name's James Radley from jamesrad.com and I hope to speak to you soon.